and welcome to another video tutorial from Creati. Today we're working with React.js. I'm going to show you how to add Lottie animations to your React apps. The first step is finding a Lottie animation collection to find some new designs. Uh, we'll use a design from the Marketing Animated Illustrations collection. And we have quite a few cohesive designs that look great on a web page. We're going to go with marketing strategy. Okay, on the product page, we have a couple options. We can, we can change to a static image or keep as an animation. And we can also adjust the colors. Um, we're going to make this a little more chromatic, monochromatic. I'll change this to gray, a little bit lighter, perfect. And we'll do a dark red accent. Looks good. Um, let's go ahead and download. Download the JSON file. We're going to put this on our desktop so we can add to our folder later. And um, we'll go into VS Code and navigate to our um, root directory for our React app. Mine's called React Create React. Okay, and now we'll install this npm package. Um, you can find the link in the article. Um, we have the documentation here, and we'll actually be using this sample code to show you how Lottie Animation works in React. All right, back to VS Code. So you would want to npm install react dash Lottie, but I've already installed it. Um, so the next step would be creating your React app. You're going to want to type in npm npx create react app, name it. I've named mine tutorial and we'll do dash dash use dash n npm because we're not going to use yarn. I've already done this, so I'm just going to navigate to my React app. CD tutorial and um, before we start the app, let's add the file to our src folder. Let's change this. There we go. So marketing, lowercase, perfect. We'll take the old file out. All right. Now we're ready to run a React app. NPM start. All right, everything looks good. It's running in the browser. Um, okay, so we're gonna go into our SRC folder and we're gonna work in app.js. We will delete everything from this file. And I have some code ready to go We'll do an import. Okay. 
Um, it's not going to work until we add some more lines, but this is basically importing React and the NPM package, so we can use certain syntax. And then we'll export our React component. Paste this in. Okay. And then we'll add a render function. Um, we have a more detailed description of what each of these components do, but it's basic, um, basic web development in React. I mean, if you've used React, you're familiar with all this, so we don't need to get into a big explanation. And then we'll return. The animation and set the height and width. Okay. And then I'm going to show you how to make a button afterwards. We'll go back into React folder. Um, I think everything is good. We don't need a semicolon here. Okay. Looks good, we'll save, and we'll see if we have any errors. Looks good. There we go, our animation has rendered, and looks nice. Um, let's show you how, how easy it is add a button and some controls. We're going to add this button into our render function. Okay, and then some code to control it. Um, this is just setting the state and then this is um, adding buttons and then setting state when they're pressed pretty basic. We're going to add here. That looks good. I think it should work. There we go. Um, can stop the animation, play, pause. Looks good. All right, thanks for watching another Creaty tutorial. Stay tuned for more. We'll cover more web development tools and how to implement Lottie animations.